And so the first dibs question is, who's going to win the World Series? This is the way too early prediction. Way too early? We're here, man. We're here. We got 12 teams. This is eight teams playing for the wild card to get to the division series. This is the time when you throw down dibs because the odds won't be any better than what you see right now. Now, my heart is with the Orioles. My head is with the Braves. (laughs) But my money is on Miami. Wow. It's good odds, man. I mean, what are you the know, odds? You know the odds. I, I don't what know them the right odds? off the top of my head. I'll get them are before you're done. Are they the longest odds? To- they got to be. They've got to be. They've got to be the, the biggest plus on your $100 bills. Uh, but you know this team. What was it? 97? Uh, 2005? Six, three. three? 2003. Yeah, that was Bartman year. And the pandemic. Oh, yeah, 97. I was there at 96. I knew they were going to win the World Series the next just year. I predicted it, it. my first job for it. Fox. I know. I just I missed my second World Series <laughs> ring. But um, And they did want me to come back. I just couldn't do it. But I had no interest in doing it. I came back in 98 with the Padres. but And I knew the Padres were going to be great. Kevin Kevin Brown was like, listen, dude, you got to stay. we got a great team. I'm like, dude, I, I can't I can't lift my arm to wipe my butt. I can't pitch anymore. I got to get out of here. Yeah, you could have rode the bench and been I'm not living a bench with a rider. World Series <laughs> ring, though. No way. I'd never mm-hmm. wear that mm-hmm. ring. Okay, I got the odds for you here before you make your picks. It is just plus 260 to pick the Braves right now. Plus 410, Dodgers in second place. After that, plus 480, Astros. Orioles at plus 700. hey yo. Philadelphia Phillies plus twelve hundred, Tampa Bay Rays plus twelve hundred, Rangers plus eighteen hundred, Minnesota Twins there as well plus eighteen hundred, plus two thousand for the Blue Jays and the Brewers. Ooh, that Brewers plus two thousand. Hey yo. So what? I bet a hundred. I won two thousand. Correct. Oh, I might have to throw a hundred. I on like that. that. As a Brewer, but the my well Diamondbacks plus four thousand. Miami Marlins. So hundred to get four thousand. That's right. Who's giving these odds? This is crazy. I love it. Plus five thousand for your Miami Marlins. That's why you're betting Marlins. And my money's Those are some Miami. long odds. Ten dude. bucks get you five hundred. Come on, come on. I like it. What do you got? Who you got? All right, listen. I never count this? out the Dodgers. They got too many good players. Um, I think out of, out of the National League will be Dodgers, Braves, top two, chalk stuff, um, chalk talker, mid damn. Astros are always money. I know. And, and they got to buy. They're I love the good. Orioles. They may be a little young for this. Um, I already got money on the on the Rays. Um, I might put money on one of them jerseys. Those, those de- jerseys are sweet. Those, devil the, those are the Wade Boggs 3,000 hit jerseys right there. That's Jose Canseco was in those jerseys. You know who else that was managing? Larry Rothschild was their first manager. We, could I get an Andre Dawson Devil Rays? Does that exist? Absolutely, probably does. Excellent. So there's been but some... that's, I love the color scheme. Yeah, that's why I like it. Yeah, that's why I like it. But I listen, I've always been, th- this is why they need a new stadium. I hope they support them. There's empty seats in the house. That's sickening to me. Come on. You can't, mm-hmm. you can't support this team that... Uh, 99 wins again this year on a limited budget. They're just they're they're so steady. A lot of so seats steady. available for the Tampa Bay. Always Rays changing today. personnel, but not changing attitude. All right, so you got the Dodgers, you got the Braves. I got, I got Astros. Yeah, I, are always my number there. one, my one A pick are the Braves. I got the Braves winning it all. I, I think that they're just so strong in every facet of the game. Um, but listen, that's baseball, man. You get some some guys that get hot pitching wise. Right. You get in a Rose Arena that all of a sudden gets hot hitting. I mean, every team will have them. And you called it the first RBI by the Rangers is Tavares, one of the last guys on the team that you're thinking, oh, that's that's the dude. So uh, I was listening to a great podcast that had David Wright on there, and David Wright was making some great points. He's like some of the best hitters that he played against, whether it's Manny Ramirez or David Ortiz and guys in their day, they would only hit about 25 home runs a year. But they would drive in 140. Juan Gonzalez, guys like always driving in 140, 150, hitting 280 because they were good hitters. They were good situational hitters. That's the the key there. Situational hitters. I think the teams that have those guys are going to win. Yeah. And <laughs> Freddie Freeman, Mookie Betts. I know guys I, like that. Uh, 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 Os- Os- Osuna's a very good guy. Yeah, Albies, uh, Acuna. I mean, you know, look at Matt Olson. I think Matt Olson had like 140 RBI this year. He's stupid good. Home run king. Yeah, but everybody's talking about, I hit all those home runs. No, the guy's hitting, no, 280, 300, some of these guys. Acuna's hitting 340, 340.